This is the latest creation from Vex Robotics. It's the mechanical overview of the air cannon, starting with 20 pound aluminum high pressure air tank. Tank contains 2200 psi of compressed nitrogen. The industrial regulator controls that 2200 psi, drops it down to a, a usable 150 psi. I uh, have a quarter inch high pressure air hose going to a industrial pneumatic valve here, which releases the pressure into the accumulator tank. The accumulator tank here is 400 cubic inches. It has a quarter inch wall thickness, all made out of 6061 aluminum, very, very strong, all nicely welded. See, is here is the uh, pressure release valve. Uh, this pressure relief valve exhausts any excess pressure uh, into the atmosphere and uh, releases at 150 psi. Here we have the heart of the beast. This is an industrial one inch high flow pneumatic valve. This valve cycles at 11 milliseconds, meaning that the 150 psi of compressed nitrogen in this accumulator tank goes from here into this high pressure air hose very, very quickly. Now, one inch high pressure air hose then exhaust all of that nitrogen into the barrel. The barrel is a three inch diameter, 30 inches long, 200 cubic inch volume. Um, the barrel itself is 1 16th inch wall thickness. The trunnion is 1 8th inch wall thickness. Um, again, all out of 6061 aluminum. Very, very strong. Now, we have four motors, two on this side and two on this side. And these motors work in conjunction to elevate the barrel. We have two motors down at the base of the turret. Those motors, as you've seen so far, will uh, allow the barrel, uh, or allow the turret to rotate a full 360 degrees. And the barrel elevates from zero degrees up to probably 80 degrees. And it can, of course, elevate and turn at the same time. That is the mechanical overview of the latest creation from Vex Robotics. I know you want to see it shoot.